also new tonight. Fisher Theater in Danville was fully restored right before the pandemic, but they haven't had many opportunities to bring in large crowds. Now, the theater is trying to make a comeback. WCIA 3's Jared Farmer joins us in the studio. Jared, can you tell us how they're making this happen? Bryce Fitcher Theater announced earlier this afternoon they'd be partnering with the Danville Symphony Orchestra for a series of shows to put the theater back on the map. The theater is hosting three live symphonies later this year, and I talked with Fisher's executive director, who tells me this move is a no-brainer. He says he's excited because this partnership with the symp symphony rather gives both parties an opportunity to bring a spark back to downtown Danville. And I think the fact that these two organizations were, were able to see that and see that big picture and realize that if we can combine our resources, I mean, really, the community is, is really only going to benefit that much more, and uh, it, it strengthens all of us. And the symphony orchestra begins transitioning from the Dick Van Dyke Theater to Fisher tomorrow. Fisher will be where they hold most of their concerts right now, but the symphony will still perform at their traditional venue from time to time. The first show is going to be set for October 2nd. Bryce, back to you. All right, Jared, thank you.